Good afternoon. Uh, my name is Sanjay. I'm part of the Solutions IQ team, and here with me uh, is Ravindra. And uh, we just concluded the Agile Coffee Talk. And Ravindra, you had a great session, right? Uh, so why don't you tell about yourself, uh, uh, Ravindra? Sure. Uh, uh, I'm Ravindra, who okay, mm -hmm. has head of engineering technology in Tesco. I take care of two areas. One is supplier collaboration. Second one is price and promotions. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I've been in Tesco for 11 mm -hmm. years. And uh, yes. uh, great news is that today I complete my 18 years in IT industry. Oh, wonderful. That is fantastic. Yeah. So, uh, before Tesco, I was with uh, Infosys and TCS, mm -hmm. uh, so that's what uh, I do. And you had a great session, Ravindra, right? Uh, I, I was part of the session, I could see the response. Uh, what did you tell it about uh, the topic uh, which you had chosen to talk in the Agile Coffee Talk today and uh, a little bit about it? So yeah. today I spoke about uh, Enterprise Agile Transformation. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. So we did this journey almost two years back. So I thought uh, it is a good platform for me to share uh, mm -hmm. what are the pain points that I had and then uh, what are the challenges. Mm -hmm. And also most important thing is uh, what are the lessons learned that I had okay. so that I can okay. share the best practices with the industry. Mm -hmm. So whatever the struggles that I had, uh, my expectation is that if somebody is trying to do this transformation, mm -hmm. they shouldn't go through. They was get benefit. Right? And yeah. that's the purpose of uh, this community uh, event also yeah. where the practitioners come and share their experiences so that we as a community learn from that right and i was again part of the session i think it was a great session a lot of people had many questions they talked to you during yeah. the session also even after that right so uh, if you have any uh, set of specific lessons uh, which uh, our listeners can t take away sure uh, would you like to share that please so i would say there are uh, four points that i would like to uh, I would like to have the industry to learn from this particular uh, my experience. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The first one is uh, any agile transformation. Uh, there has to be the leadership support. There, there needs to be leadership support. Absolutely. And there has to be executive support. Absolutely. Otherwise, it will not be very successful. And it has to be a top-down approach rather than only the bottom-up approach. Yeah. Many times so, we have. That's right. Either so, one and then. That's right. it so, in right. fact, I was actually speaking to one person right now. So, in their organization, they had a. Testing as a vertical, uh -huh. but then the vertical doesn't want to be agile. So then what happens is in the flow, uh, agile will not be successful. So unless they change their That becomes uh, an impediment. Yeah, that's right, absolutely. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The second one I would like to say is uh, the team level agile transformation or the change uh -huh. uh, will not really make the entire enterprise to be agile uh, uh, agile transition that's right the that's reason right. being uh, uh, there would be one small team where they would like to do all the ceremonies etc but all. then oh. until unless they get the support from the other areas they will not be successful so that is the second point yes yes so the third point that i would like to highlight is uh, mm -hmm. if you take process tools and the people in the agile transformation people makes an important role mm -hmm. so in the session i did give a few examples so one example is uh, if you have uh, uh, let's say eight to ten scrum teams mm -hmm. on the floor uh, it actually makes a lot of sense to have the stand up at the same time the reason being when in an activity is done in the tandem in the floor the energy levels are very very high and then the different absolutely so in absolutely. case if if you are trying to uh, implement this particular thing i, I would expect uh, i mean i would i would think this is a great experiment to start with mm -hmm. um, so that that is one great lesson learned for me the second one is we also tried uh, something called flash sprints where you would not do the sprint in two weeks but then try to do it in 24 hours mm -hmm. a lot of times uh, hackathons are done for the innovation but the the idea is uh, uh, why to uh, why to only work on the products that would be used in the future or may not be used in the future so most of the times hackathon products may not be useful but then what about uh, the business is struggling for something today and then you go on and do it in 24 hours and then uh, it's a massive surprise to the business. That's what which uh, I had seen in, in my work. Which is area. what you saw that yeah. as a part of the that's flash right. prints and all. Right. Right. I think that's a great experiment. Maybe the others can try that too, right? Okay. Yeah. So the last one and fourth point is uh, while leadership is bought into the idea, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, they can only give a direction, but then uh, the execution ideally should be left to the agile teams or the scrum teams. The reason being, uh, uh, especially uh, in our company, there is a lot of uh, freedom to the teams to go on and experiment. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that actually led to try something and then if it is successful, you go on and do it. Otherwise, uh, you actually pick up some other thing. I think that experimentation, uh, that is brilliant. I think those are the four learnings. Uh, That's I, right. I that experimentation mindset and then 
having an environment for the freedom the risk, of freedom yeah, and then fail and then again do it and to learn from that's it that's right i think yeah. that's a journey so that's wonderful right so i think uh, with that uh, uh, thank you for being part of the the session and uh, we appreciate you coming here and sharing your experience thanks for inviting actually thank yeah, you yeah. thank you very much nice meeting thank you, you. thank you